Hey guys, what's up? Josh here, and in this video, I'm going to show you some really cool areas you can kind of glitch your way to in Destiny on the moon. And a lot of people say it's part of the upcoming uh, expansion pack that Bungie's going to release called House of Wolves. And um, so I'm going to show you Trader's Catch and uh, Dusk Warrens. So it's a really fun way to get to. It can be a little frustrating if you don't get it at first, um, but we're going to go ahead and jump into it. Um, I'm going to go to Patrol on the Moon and uh, just kind of fast forward all the way to um, the areas we need to go. And ultimately we want to make our way to Circle of Bones and then uh, the World's Grave. Um, but uh, you guys can kind of find your way there. I'm not going to go too in depth on that because uh, you most likely already went through the story and uh, know where that's at. But if not, you guys can kind of uh, get an idea with that fast forwarded part. And um, so yeah, like I said, we're going to end up at the World's Grave. And uh, so right here on the left, there's going to be um, some enemies all the way down there. You can just pick them off. Um, but on the very left, um, there's going to be some sort of like uh, crystal structure light um, thing going on over here along with these banners that we're ultimately going to hop up onto. And so I'm going to hop on the very tip of this light and then just kind of triple jump. And by the way, I am a hunter. And uh, so they're usually pretty, I think, a little bit more hard to use while jumping and stuff. But I managed to go all the way through. And um, But throughout this video, just kind of follow my steps. You guys can pause it, go back, and uh, just take your time because it um, may be going a little bit quicker than um, the process actually takes. So you guys can um, pause it, and I guess that's what this video is for, is for you guys to learn how to do it. But um, after a couple of tries and stuff, you guys will probably get this so down uh, pat that you don't even have to look at the video anymore when you want to go show your friends or something like that. Um, but if you don't feel like showing them, you can just refer them to this video or something like that. So yeah, like I said, just go through this video and kind of see what I'm doing. There were some kind of really dark spots uh, throughout the video that I kind of edited up and uh, lit it up a bit more. Hopefully that helps a, like, uh, a lot more than uh, you can actually see. Like right here it's kind of dark, but ultimately you want to hop up on this pillar. So I fell, but sometimes it'll redirect you right back to where you left off, so that's useful. Um, but I'm at the pillar that I ran across, and I want to go all the way across the map uh, for this part, all the way to the right, kind of hop up, triple jump, stay along this ridge to the right, and then you want to keep going to the right, Right here, there's gonna be an invisible wall, so just kind of keep maneuvering your way through. That part, it looks like there's gonna be a drop off, but uh, it'll carry you all the way through. Now we're back up to the pillar again, and you kind of have to jump up until you get it. Then you wanna go to this pillar, go all the way through to the rocks, and then this part, you can just walk straight through the mountain, and uh, it's kind of just, it's there, but not really there physically, so you can just walk through it. And um, I find myself looking down at this ground, very helpful. It's like right here, look down there, but jump up top, and then look to your right. This is a tricky part, so kind of take your time. And you want to jump up and go to the right, ultimately landing on like this invisible wall of some sort. It took me a couple times, and if you fall at like a awkward angle, then you'll have to like restart the whole thing, which really sucks. Um, but for the most part, if you like m do the little misadventure thing, um, you should be respawning at the part where you left off. Uh, so right here, we're at like this little circle, circular area. I'm just gonna run around to the uh, other side until we get to this door that you can see at the bottom. Then you just wanna go straight, and right at the top, there's like this little house figure. You want to jump up on top of it, and then this is where it gets really dark for some reason on my screen. So um, you just kind of want to keep jumping forward, and then eventually on your left you'll see another little house figure. Let's see, wait for it to pop up. Um, yeah, for some reason it got really dark and I threw a grenade to kind of light it up. Um, luckily I didn't kill myself right there, but... Um, so yeah, right here to our left was another house. We're just going to jump up on top of that and walk forward even more. And uh, down there you can see more like structure. Look up again, there's another little house type figure, part of the building. Hop up on that and ultimately you will fall down. And you're inside this new 
kind of looking area and uh, oh I didn't do it yet <laughs> I'm a little bit ahead of the video but right here I think yep we're in this new little zone and uh, kind of look around and explore and uh, once you go over to these steps you're in Dusk Warren so then you can explore even more and it's so amazing because this is the first time I actually experienced a cold teleporter thing and uh, you'll see that in just a second um, but there's a nice little scenery going on and uh, like I said the teleporter right here can't remember if I jumped or not but um, I went in the center of that and it lifted me up and then I teleported to this zone and I uh, did a bit more exploring which was very nice to see and uh, I'm still in Dusk Warren but uh, as you progress further throughout the uh, map you'll see uh, that you'll make your way all the way to Trader's Catch and uh, this is another really neat area so um, let me know what you guys think Destiny or excuse me Bungie has planned for these areas like will they be um, like will be a raid or some of some sort um, let me know in the comments below and also right here was a little glitch of my friend um, we were going throughout the map and doing that glitch and her cape got all screwed up so uh, she was dancing and uh, so we thought that was pretty funny thought I'd throw that in there too so if you guys enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up leave a comment let me know what you guys think subscribe for more videos I'll post in the future and until next time I will see you guys later